everyone in this video I'm going to be teaching you how to set up your phone and customizing it using um, the Nova Launcher and the Universal Clock Widget both of these you can get for free Nova Launcher you can buy the Prime um, for a few dollars, a couple pounds um, but you don't need it to get your phone to look something like this you don't need it at all um, it's just something simple with uh, the icon widgets, uh, the, the icon packs, etc. So, first of all, what we're going to do is you're going to need Nova Launcher. So, you can find it pretty easily. You just search the Play Store and you'll find it. It is by Tesla Call Software. So, what you have to do you install it and you will get the option to use it as your home screen and you want to go ahead and say yes because the home screen initially will look like this this is what your home screen will look like and what we want to do is try and change that so we can make it look just how you want it to at the moment this is what you've got and it's a bit it's good, you've got everything you need, but it's pretty boring. So, what we do is we go to device and we find home screen. Go to default applications in the general settings, we find home and we put it to Nova Launcher. So then we go back, it's like that. So, how do we get all of these? Okay, well, we've got Nova Launcher, we've got your apps that you want, um, etc. What we need now is the Universal Clock Widget. So, we go to the Play Store, we search, and all we have to type in is U C C. W and it will be this one. It's by Vasudev. Click on it, download it. When it comes up, it will. You, you can design your own and you can do all of this stuff, but you don't have to. What you do is you can go online to a number of different places. This is one of them. So if we just do, you can find this one. So say we want this one, circles. So, uh, circulars. So we find the one we want, we install it, we wait for it to install. It shouldn't take too long because a lot of them are just small um, widgets. And basically what, CC, what UCCW is, is a clock widget. So other people design them and then they will upload them to the Play Store to different places. And um, you can find them. So while that one's downloading, I may as well show you the other ones. How to use the Universal Clock Widget is once you've changed your, once you've got your own home screen, you can basically hold stuff down, drag it around, move it, and if you drag it to the top, you can get rid of it. So, to insert a widget for UCCW, is you hold down on the screen, and you'll get this. You go to Widgets, and once it loads, you scroll, oops, you scroll all the way down until you find UCCW, which is here. You tap it. And then you have the sizes. So if you want a little one, like 2x2, two two, or you want a bigger one, you can. Um, the 2x2 two two and the 4x4 four four and all of this sort of stuff is how many rows and angles it uses up. So if I choose the 4x4, four four, it will give me a list of stuff that I have downloaded. So these are the ones that I've downloaded so far. I've got a bunch. There's loads of different types. You can get all of these ones. I haven't paid for any of these. You can just find them on the Play Store or online places. So say I want this one, smart. I tap it, and it will give me that 4x4, four four, um, the 4x4 four four clock that I wanted. But it's a bit small, so I want it bigger. So I hold down. This is all due to Nova. You don't need anything else. This is all Nova. I press resize, and there I can drag it. So I want it bigger. I want to bring the whole, the whole uh, screen. But now if I try and click on this, 
I can't. It loads up Universal Clock Widget because this um, is basically where the square is. It takes up most of the screen. So what we need to do is same way you're, if you're on a Word document and you want a picture to go backwards, you just hold it down and you go center back. So now I can click on anything and click on that and so it's underneath it or I can click on Chrome desktop. I can do whatever I need to and it's not going to get in my way. Okay, so the other one I had was, I think it was called the effing weather. So back, hold down, go to widgets, and this one, I'll, I'll put the links in the description and everything, but this one um, is you don't have to go down to um, UCCW, it's, it's a separate widget, so once you download it, you find it. It's It got taken off the Play Store a little while ago, so the link that I put in the description may or may not work by the time you try it, but if you Google F weather, or I think it was called bleeping weather um, by someone else, then um, you'll find it very easily. So you just tap it, and here you can have the buttons on the widget so you can see the different things, that um, uh, the different options and stuff, but I've left it quite plain. You can have a dark mode or not, then you just press done, and there's not enough space because if you look at this, we've used it up. So if we make that a bit smaller, or in fact if we just get rid of it, we can then do it again, go back to widgets, find it. It's, I mean, some, some little bits are tedious, but once you get the hang of it, you can switch and choose them really, really quickly. So done. And there we've got it. And from here, we can just resize it and do what we have to do. And it's, it's pretty good. So um, the other thing that I have is the icons, which are blitz. There's hundreds of thousands of different icon packs that you can buy, you can download for free, you can do anything. I got the free version of this, but I bought the the um, the full version simply because I liked it. Um, sorry about that. Um, simply because I liked it. So um, it was only like 80 pence or something in, in pounds, so it was really simple. Um, with Blitz you can apply the theme, which basically means, and then you choose your launcher, because there's, there's loads of different types of launchers. You go to another launcher and it will replace all of your icons that have the um, are available for this app and it will replace them um, straight onto your it will just replace all the icons so you don't have to worry about doing it yourself oh, um, let me just get rid of that um, so yeah so once you've done that you pick your launcher and then you just press ok it'll do it and then all of your icons will be um, on that thing on the uh, with that icon pack. What also you can do with the icon pack is it gives you wallpapers. So you can change your wallpapers. You can do a bunch of stuff. Okay, so so that's the simple. That's just the extra bits. That's just the clocks. That's just the weather. That's just the icons. Nova Launcher is is very in depth of what how you want stuff to look. You can change the width of your things. You can change the height. You can change loads of different stuff, how many home screens you have, the scroll effect, how it scrolls when you change it, like you can change the scroll indicator to the bars, so then when we go back, it's bars, see, so there's there's tons of stuff you can do, oh, let me go back here, and put that back, well, um, one thing that a lot of people do when they design their own themes, like they have the Pip-Boy from Fallout Boy, um, some people have made uh, Borderlands ones. You can f you can find pictures and tutorials and stuff for the whole in depth thing with these launchers and different launchers. Like uh, there's there's tons of different ones, but here you can change your desktop grid. So basically, at the moment, mine's six by five because it's just what I'm used to. It has enough for the apps that I want to use, and um, it's not cramped. It's it's plenty of space. But you can change that all the way up to twelve twelve, and all the way down to 2-2. Two, two. So if we put it on say 10-12, it's what it's basically going to do it'll, is it'll give you a grid that is 10 rows by 12 columns and that basically means that you can fit, obviously you can fit 10 um, apps down and you know you have a lot more space so if we do that, it was on 6-5 wasn't it? Okay so we do that and then we go back to the home screen. 
See, everything's been <laughs> fucking. Everything's been um scrunched up because we've got all this room now. So everything is a lot smaller and squished. So that would be more if you're kind of trying to fit a lot more stuff in, or you have bigger widgets that you want to fit in there. But for now, um, I'm going to keep mine on six five because that's what mine is, and it, everything fits like that. So you can change all of that yourself. You can have a big play around. Um, the other thing is what I've done is I've taken the labels off. So I had them on before. See? So you can see WhatsApp, blah, blah, contact and stuff. Um, I did have music there, didn't I, as well? There, that's another thing. Get an app. Rewards. We have to do it's the same as anything else. You just hold it down and you can drag it wherever you want. You can put it in um, folders. You can make a folder with something else by just dragging it on, and you've got a folder. Really, 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 really easy to um, to do. But I'm because I'm used to my uh, my icons without having um, names. You can turn that off if you want to. What you can also do is um, edit icons. So you can change the name of it. So if I wanted it just to be Insta, I can do that. If I wanted to change the icon, I can do that by just tapping on the icon. And I can change it into a bunch of different ones that the guy's made. And he updates them quite constantly as well. But your your um, icons can be anything. You can change it into an actual picture of something that you have yourself. You can do loads of stuff. So, see, you can change it. But I don't like the I don't like having the names on, so I'm gonna go ahead and change that back. So as you can see, with me just kind of going through, there's loads of different stuff you can change, and this is just a desktop. You can change the drawers, you can change pretty much anything you can think of to change the look and the feel, as it says. You can do. You can change. See, so you can change the size. You can go in here this way and change the icon pack to anything that you have downloaded. can change the font of stuff um, some some things that you do have to um, see this says prime so you there are some things that you have to pay for but not, like most of the stuff that you don't um, that you'd want to to change like because I've done everything here and it's not it's nothing too flashy it's nothing too crazy but it works for me and um, that was all free the only thing I bought was an ATP icon pack because I really liked it so that's simple Let's go ahead and put our clock back, just to remind ourselves. Um, obviously, I, I haven't been making a lot of videos recently because I just haven't really had the time. But um, if there's anything regarding this, I was thinking of doing a, um, a torrenting video for um, uh, Android and stuff because it's, it can be quite easy to um, mess up and it can also be really easy to actually learn. So. If you if you would like a torrent video, let me know, um, and I can work on that. Because I've got um, uTorrent and stuff, you know, it, it shouldn't be difficult for me to do something. So that's it, pretty much. Um, if there's anything you have, uh, if you have any questions about anything or how certain apps work, oh, what was that? Um, if uh, if I have them, or you know, I'll, I'll try and do something with them if I can. So, um, yeah, thanks a lot, and um, I'll talk to you later.